Hello there, this video is for you if you want to know how to mod the Fallout 3 Game of the Year Edition, which was free for a while on Epic Store. Now first, what we need to do is to launch the game. If this is the first time you install the game and you have no save files before, this will, what, will, what this will do is it's going to create the configuration files, which the uh, what we're going to install further is going to need. Um, for me, I already have uh, save files and stuff, so I already have the uh, any files created. So let's go now to the fellow anniversary patcher. What this does is it downgrades the game and adds some improvements that we will need. It downgrades the version of the game to the one that is compatible with the most of the mods out there on Nexus mods. Now we switch downloading. We're going to go to download the mod organizer too. Now the links to all of these are going to be in the video description. We download this one right here, the CXE. Now while it's downloading, I'm uh, going to go and uh, set up the uh, fellow anniversary patcher. I'm just going to drag it here to my desktop. Now what it requires us to do is to put all the files in the uh, in the game where, where the game is installed as you can see here it says you need to put these files where the fallout3.exe is located and then we run the patcher so we're gonna go to where the game is installed for me it's right here in games it could be different for you depending on where you install the game and then what we need to do is drag and drop everything to fallout to where the fallout.exe exists with for me in uh, fallout 3 Godi, uh english now once we're doing that we're gonna run it this one as admin as, as admin and it's gonna say click anything to exit now that's done we're gonna go to install the mod organizer 2 it's gonna give us this warning right here we can click on run we accept next then next again. Uh, for me, I'm gonna disable the. Uh, I'm not gonna install the translations because I'm morally. I'm, I'm just gonna stick with English. Then uh, we'll click on next. Next again. I'm gonna make a shortcut on the desktop. Since we're gonna need this organizer to launch the game anyway. From here, I'm gonna click on next then we're going to create a global instance then we're going to locate our game which is fallout 3 we will go to the previous folder where the game is installed and we select that folder just as you see right here then fallout 3 Godi. here we select it it's going to say game of the year uh, fallout 3 i'm going to go next and next next again next and finish click on yes click on use old one click on this on this prompt as well now this is uh, our mod organizer now here I'm going to show you how to we're going to need one more thing we're going to need the fallout script extender which is right here it's a simple website we click on this link right here it's a very small file we take it and we uh, put it where the game is installed as well we drag and drop everything and that's it we don't need to do anything from here once we launch the game from the mod organizer it's gonna launch with the extender as well now to check if it's properly installed we're gonna run this following command by pulling out the console using the uh, shown key and if it's not installed properly it's gonna give you the following error but if it's installed properly it's gonna show you the following we click on uh, the uh, we show the console and we type the following fose version 
and it should show us the version of the fellow extender. Here I'm going to show you how to install mods using the mod manager. We click on the files tab and click on download and slow download. It's going to give us this prompt right here to open it with mod manager. We click on yes <coughs> and we go to the downloads tab in the f mod organizer and you can see the progress here. I'm going to skip ahead and it's downloaded. Now we download the patch that comes with it, which is an update to the to this mod I'm installing, which gives us the iron sights. Now from here I'm going to show you how to install the mod and its update as well. We just right click on the mod we want, which is this one, and we click on proceed here. Uh, okay. Then now to install the update, we click on install from here. Now I'm just going to disable this one so it doesn't pop up in the future. In the future, from here we click on merge. This will merge all the files with the existing files, and we click on this check mark right here. We go to sort. Every time we install a new mod, we, we need to sort the order. Now, once the order is done sorting out, we just click on close, which is going to show up. Each time we run the game, now it, we're just going to run it from the run. Also, by the way, if you want to know how America, to do the same, as in how to install the mods for the Fallout New Vegas, I have another video which I'm going to link in the pinned comment section for you to check out once you finish this game or maybe you just want to um, try to play that game as well on the Epic Game Store. That's it. Enjoy the rest of the video and peace out. Ugh! <laughs>